And this is the uh, city of South San Francisco police station, roughly 44,000 square feet footprint just in the building alone. This project is a design bid build project, metal stud framing and drywall. And what we've asked Dusty to do is to lay out the wall lines as well as finish lines, along with a couple items that we added in the idea process of making this thing better. My name is Tessa Lau. I am the CEO and co-founder at Dusty Robotics. We create robot-powered tools for the modern construction workforce. What we're starting with is a Dusty Robotics field printer. The Dusty field printer takes BIM models and it turns it into constructible layout. We have a great innovations department. They've done a great job really pushing good products towards us. And when, when I saw the printer with wheels, I thought it would be a great idea to have out here. What we tried to do was integrate some of the things that would have held us up from going straight from conventional layout, which would be MEP openings, layout of sizes, stud layouts. It really takes this paint by numbers idea and simplifies the work that needs to be installed in the field. I never imagined that. This is like welcome to the Jetsons or something for me. But either you get with the times or you get out of the way and I think this is where it's going. Our schedule is accelerated because layout is one of the longest duration items that the framer has to do because we always have form and layout because they're the most experienced. It is one of the hardest things that you have to do. Typically, it probably would have took me a week to lay out the project and they got it done in two days. We spend a lot of time working on our 3D coordinated model. So the fact that we're able to take the true CAD drawing of the walls and print them on the ground accurately is, is truly invaluable. I even like to do this when I do layout, I'll go back and check my numbers just in case I happen to put a line on the wrong side. So I went around and checking Dusty and honestly I was kind of hoping I would find something but I didn't find anything wrong, which, which is really good. Accuracy and layout is paramount when it comes to placing things in the right location. The big money problem is if we're even off by three eighths, you won't see it until they go to put the finishes in and then they're like, this cabinet doesn't fit or this equipment doesn't fit in here. It's too late pretty much by that point. It's going to cost a lot. Just in the first day, there was three items that we were able to locate. There was HSS steel that was out of the wall, and there was two pipes that were out of the wall. We were able to put an RFI for that and have them correct that before we even started doing any framing. So yeah, that, that, was, that was big. And the day after, we had the other trades correct their misplaced pipes due to those errors. So that actually helped the other MEP trades as well. I really hope that other companies start using it because it would be super valuable to have the whole job laid out robotically. And I hope to see more automated layout in the future. Tessa and the Dusty team have been great. I would definitely recommend. I wish I could duplicate this job and do it again.